how to apply a basic camera zoom and position adjustment setting to a video clip in DaVinci Resolve 17.4.3. Inside my project's edit window, the video clip that I wish to apply a zoom and position adjustment to is currently on my timeline with the red playhead in place at the very first frame. I wish for the whole video clip to be in view with the default zoom and position settings applied to the first three seconds of this video clip. Once the three second mark has been reached, I wish for the focus to be shifted towards the top right corner with the gentle zoom and pan effect applied. After the two second transition is complete, the updated zoom and position settings will be applied to the rest of the video clip so that we maintain focus on the inspector section of the edit window in DaVinci Resolve. Using the selection mode tool, which you can also do by pressing A, I will first select the edits on my timeline, go to inspector, and underneath transform, select keyframes for both the zoom and position properties, so that the settings for these will be applied to the rest of the video clip unless they are adjusted at a later frame. Now select and drag the red playhead to a point further down the timeline, to where you wish for the zoom and panning transition to start from. You can also hold in K and tap L to shift the red playhead manually once to the right, or hold in K and tap J to move the red playhead to the left. Now select the same keyframe diamond icons next to zoom and position once again to apply these particular settings to the 3 second mark. I will now drag my red playhead to the point on my timeline where I wish for the zoom and panning effect to be complete by. In this case here it will be at the 5 second mark. With the red playhead in place, I will return to the inspector window and underneath transform I will adjust the zoom and position X and Y values. Adjust each of these properties until you are satisfied with what you have in view. These particular values will be applied to the final 5 seconds of my video clip. And if I go back to the start and preview, we can see a basic zoom and panning effect taking place. The background music in this tutorial is provided by the Proud Channel Sponsor Audio, a link to the company's website and to one that will provide a discounted purchase of a lifetime supply of music and sound effects can be found in this video's description box. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video, take care.